Howdy friends and neighbors, my name is Austin Salyer. And my name is Kennedy Keyston. And, and this, this is, is your, your weekly, weekly news report. report. Ms. Scott's AP Biology and Ecology class both had field trips towards Jenny Wiley yesterday. Junior's powder puff shirt money is due to Miss Huffman by Tuesday. If you do not pay, you will not receive a shirt. FBLA members, dues are to be turned in by October 15th. When you turn in your money, you may also be able to pick an event. 41 people gave blood Wednesday for National Honor Society. Thank you to all those who came out. Get the first edition to the newspaper for 25 cents. Teens of Care delivered the goodie bags to the police and fire department. Special thanks to the members who donated. And this has been all for your weekly, weekly news report. report. My name is Austin Sawyer. And my name is Keys. And this is Longhorn. Oh, bringing you your news. news. Dab on them. Oh. You're not even in it! I'm not? Oh. Oh! 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 oh. <laughs>you're arrested for what is this 1984 you're under arrest for reading a banned book because i know why the cage bird sings stop with all the references this is serious all right sorry sorry i'm gonna make you an offer you can't refuse sir you're still under arrest i'm just practicing my first amendment rights for the right to read whatever i please so you mean i can read gossip girl yes and any other banned book Look, banned books are the Library Association's books that has either been challenged or banned but by an individual, a school, or a library. Now, this does not necessarily mean that they are illegal. You can still read or acquire them. Books like Harry Potter or Captain Underpants and even the Bible are some of the most frequently challenged books.